Hi, my name is Chris Link and welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for coming. Today we're going to talk about cracked heels. It's not a pretty topic, it's not a pretty sight, but with summer right around the corner, if you want to learn how to fix your ugly, cracked, yucky heels, stick around because we're just getting started. I always had problems with cracked heels. Um, they would crack, I couldn't walk on them absolutely horrible and I would use the stone in the bath and all that kind of stuff and get pedicures once every two weeks and it, it wouldn't matter nothing worked I would get cracked heels no matter what someone told me one time that as we're walking around just saying a basic flip-flop here in the south we actually have what you know 90 degree weather think about what the temperature of the asphalt is on a 90 degree weather and your heels your feet are right above that i mean they're very very little protecting them so no wonder we deal with such dryness and such cracked heels especially in the summertime but i have the answer yes i do and it has worked beautifully for me here's what we're going to do we're going to talk about it today okay i came across a combination of really three products i guess it's two products and one pair of socks if you will that has made a total difference in my heels so here we go let's talk about what you need to do if you want to have beautiful beautiful um, smooth heels for this spring and summer we're going to start off with a product called baby foot now if you've not seen this product yet let me make sure you can see it good if you've not seen this product yet basically what it is they are plastic booties um, they suggest that you soak your feet uh, for 20 30 minutes what i do is i take a hot bath stay in the bath for about 20 minutes or so get out to where my feet are really soft and smooth as best they can be after a bath and you open up these little booties they are made of plastic and you cut the top off of them and inside that are different acids like we put on our face that would go on your feet and what i do with mine they have a little piece of tape that you can secure it around your ankle i don't even worry about that what i do is i will slip them on and then I'll put a pair of socks on top of them to keep them uh, up next to my, my skin really, really good. And it says that you should leave it on for, I want to say it says like five for, for one hour. I'll leave it on for about two hours, so maybe you shouldn't do that. But I leave it on for about an hour to two hours, and then I go and rinse my feet off in the water, in the bathtub with soap to make sure I get all of the acid off. And then honestly, you forget about it you forget that you did this and in five to seven days your feet are going to slough off like a snake it is going to be the most amazing um, experience that you have ever had it's gross uh, there's going to be skin everywhere but all of that dead skin is going to come off so i recommend going ahead and doing this now to get that sloughing off before we hit serious serious um, sandal weather so go ahead and do this you can pick this up they have it at amazon they have it around some local spas around here so pick it up it's called baby foot there's even one for men now uh, that you can get uh, if you want your man to do it as well but you put it on leave it on an hour forget about it for five days and then you will see some some dramatic results so now what do you do to protect that baby foot skin that you've got um, after after all that dead skin has come off I have found the answer and here it is it is this product this product superior moisturizing cream with 10% is that urea 4% AHA it's by a track tain cream and it says for extreme dry cracked skin this is the most amazing cream and i will put a link or or at least tell you what it is down in the bottom i hadn't quite learned how to do all those links yet um i will i get it from amazon it's not that expensive i'll figure out what the price is and actually put that up for you as well and what i do with this cream if i'm going to exercise or something i will put some of this cream all over my feet with my socks put my tennis shoes on and go work out i will do that 
But what really works best is using this cream in conjunction with these Soft Heels Gel Sleeves. Have y'all seen these yet? I have trouble sleeping in socks because I just don't like to sleep in socks, but I don't have a problem with this. Let me show you what these are. These are a little, you see the little toes? It's just gonna cover your heels. It's gonna go halfway down your feet, so your toes are gonna stay out. And inside them, there is a little gel, little silicone or gel that is real smooth inside that makes the product the moisturizing lotion is not going to soak into the sock. It's going to stay the entire time that you're sleeping right up next to your heel. Now, I have used these with other um, lotions. I do not have the same results as I do with this product. So, what I do, I buy these at Bed Bath & Beyond. Uh, I'll find out the price of it again. I think it was $14 or $15. They last, um, they, they, I'll, I'll be honest, I probably should throw mine out more often. I probably wear them once a quarter or I use them once a quarter and then throw them out and get another, another pair to, to wear. And I will sleep in them four to five times a week. And I'm going to tell you, I have no problems whatsoever with ugly, dry, cracked, heels anymore and mine used to be so painful y'all they really did and when bobby and i when we came across this i'll be honest we the holy grail i know that a lot of youtubers say that this combination is the holy grail so guys check it out start with the baby foot really start with the baby foot it's just you don't have to but it takes care of getting all that dead skin off once and for all and it's gone and then after all the dead skin is off your feet and they're nice and smooth then start using this combination to sleep in every night uh, three to four times a week and y'all oh i shouldn't say this but now to get a full pedicure i don't get a full pedicure anymore i actually just go and have them polish my toenails davy's gonna kill me with that comment go go get your pedicures i'm sorry i shouldn't have said that um but i don't have to get full pedicures anymore ex unless i want the luxury experience of it i pay to have my toes polished and that's all because my feet are so smooth and so I, I don't really need to pay the full price unless i want just the luxury pampering so that's kind of what i do now so if you've got any questions or comments i would love to hear them please comment below if you have any other ideas on what women can do for their dry cracked heels and uh, if you like my channel, I would love for you to subscribe and join me on this journey. Click the bell, give me a thumbs up for this video because I need a lot of those, a lot of views. Send them, share to your fr friends, your family, your mother, your mother-in-law, let them know about this. This is a great little Mother's Day gift. This is a great Christmas gift. This is a great gift for men, women. It doesn't matter if anybody has dry cracked heels, this, these two products, they will, they will love you if you give them this. I promise that. Thanks again for joining me. My name is Chris Link, and I appreciate you being here, and I hope you'll come back soon because we're just getting started.